Completing a Leadership Observation For the 2014-15 school year, principals and assistant principals will be observed using the Marzano School Leadership Model. This year, we will have two formal observations that both will count toward the final evaluation. One will be before Christmas and one by June. The first observation will occur in buildings for principals and the second observation can be in buildings or the principals can meet with their supervisor at central office. For assistant principals, all meetings will happen in their building. This year, there will be 13 observable elements for assistant principals and 14 observable elements for principals. There will be a maximum of two pieces of evidence or attachments per element. Specifically, the focus of the observation will be over the entire Domain 1, Domains 2, Elements 3 through 5, Domain 4, Elements 1 through 3, and Element 5, Domain 5, Element 1, and for principles only, Domain 5, Element 5. Here is an example of the leadership framework highlighted with the important elements. Note that Domain 5, Element 5 deals with the fiscal management of a site. Here's the observation timeline. We will begin completing the first leadership conference form beginning September the 17th. Those forms will be due October the 6th. The first round of leadership observations will be from September the 29th through December 16th. The second round of leadership observations will begin in the spring. We will start working on those conference forms March the 2nd and they will be due March the 27th. The second round of leadership observations will begin April 1st and go through June the 12th. How to complete the leadership observation form. Step 1. Once you've entered into iObservation, hover over Observations, then click Leadership Conferences. Click Create a New Leadership Conference. Select I'm creating this form for myself to complete. Under Add Requested By, search for your immediate supervisor's name, then click Add. Click Next at the bottom of the page. The form should look like this. Read the first element in Domain 1. Check the boxes next to the evidences that occur in your building. Upload documents. Remember, a maximum of two for each element. To upload a file, click Choose File. You will then see all the documents that are saved on your computer. Find the document that you would like to upload and click on it and then click Open. The title of the attachment should appear in the box. To include more attachments, click Add Attachments. Complete steps 5 and 6 for each required domain and element. Click Finish. Remember, if you want to save your information and come back to it at a later time, you can always click Save and Close or Save Draft. As always, feel free to contact any member of the TLE team with questions.